I absolutely love it when I see a car which is great value for money and this is no exception. This is a Mini Countryman Sport with a full JCW pack on it which is the wheels, the bumpers. But in this case it's a 23 registration, 2,700 miles on, under manufacturer's warranty in a colour called Chili Red. This car is superb because it's quirky, it has a retro vibe to it but it's practical, it has ground clearance. It's just a brilliant car with an automatic gearbox giving you around 40 miles per gallon. I had a quick look at the finance option on PCP. With 10% deposit, you can get this car for as little as £439 per month, which is pretty impressive for a, an almost brand new vehicle. Now, obviously, there's terms and conditions that apply, so do go on the website, look at the finance calculator, get in touch with me direct. I'd be happy to give you a full breakdown, but just 10% deposit, £439 per month for a car like this, good as new, is good value. The chili red looks extremely well, especially in, in the minis. It's a good iconic colour. You've then got the full black styling. So you've got the headlight surrounds here, finished in piano black. This huge mini grille, finished in piano black, and so is the mini badges front and rear. You've then got the JCW front bumper there, which is a bit more refined, looks nice and sporty. And you have the LED daytime running lights above and down below with the fog lights. Front rear parking sensors, full LED headlights. You've then got the upgraded 19 inch circuit design wheels which have the diamond cut on the surface and then high gloss black on the inside. And then it says John Cooper's work on the middle badge just there. You've then got that lovely off-road look with the arch kit. And then you have the JCW side skirts. You've also got mud flaps and you have the mini side vents there. The mirror cap covers and the roof is completely black, which with the contrasting colours, the black and red look really good. You've got some protection glass, black roof rails, and a full tint and sliding panoramic roof. Comfort access, which is that little button there, which is a nice little touch. But then look at this interior. It's very, very modern. It's crisp. It looks good. You've got ambient lighting everywhere, Harman Kardon sound system, navigation, heated seats, automatic gearbox with the JCW steering wheel, and the John Cooper Works sport seats. You have that beautiful Alcantara finish with a squared stitching. You've also got the red detailing on the stitching as well. Before I get in, the first thing I notice is because the car has a little bit of ground clearance, getting in and out the car is very, very easy because some of the cars are too low down and you sort of dip in. Some of the 4x4s are really high up, so you have to climb in. This one, you literally step in and you step out. So it's very, very easy. But once you're in the car, you met with this, just looks. Mini's always had this little finish and I love that. I think it's quite quirky. You've then got the original dials, very easy to use for the dual zone climate control. Heated seats, front rear heated windscreen, stop start button there, um, auto sort of stop start, and then you have the different driving modes and parking sensors, etc. More ambient lighting down below, two keys. The glue box is here, a decent size with the manuals are all in there. Now this car's one owner from you with 2,700 miles on. And it is good value because you get a lot of car for your money. There's the Harman Kardon speakers, extra speakers. The ambient lighting's in here, in the bottom pocket there with the strip lighting. More Alcantara and Piano Black as well. Going back down here in the middle console, you've got the iDrive system that controls the media side of stuff. Automatic handbrake, centre armrest which lifts up with more cubby hole space underneath. And that tilt and sliding panoramic roof is really, really nice because not only is it lighting but airing. And the second section, there's electric blind which gives you more light and it just feels nice and airy. These sports seats, the bucket style seats, so you can see that they, they come out here and also here. So once you're in the car, you're in the car. But then you have all the adjustments. So like BMWs, you've got this compartment here, which section, sorry, even that pops forward, giving you more support behind your leg. This is to go up and down and that's your backrest. And then you've got down below the fully fitted rubber mini mat front and rear. As I step out comfortably, there's lots of space in the back. Now that passenger seat was my seat in position. The first thing you'll see here is that lovely sport design on the back of the seat. So as a rear passenger, it looks good. You're seeing, it's a good vision to have. This looks great. It's a one piece headrest. But I've got more than enough leg room here. Again, headroom. These headrests, they slide up so you can get nice and comfortable. Down below you have a double USC, more air vents, ice fix attachments, it really is a cracking car. There's a slider there, and then you've got the glass piece. Front airbags, side airbags, rear airbags, more pocket holes for your drinks, and that st same stuff with the Alcantara with the sweeping piano black interior inlays. You've also got the JCW Works entry kick plate, front and rear. But then you get to the back of the car, and the first thing you see is the boot lid spoiler. The rear clusters are tinted with a Union Jack half here and half there. 
Black trimmings continue. The countryman badging is bang in the centre, finished in black again. And you have a decent sized boot. Now, if you remember minis, minis have always been a quirky, good retro style car, but the minis had a tiny boot. So the countryman is family friendly. You can get your dog in there, you can get your pushchair in there, shopping, go away for the weekend. It's practical whilst a great city car at the same time. Seats go down 40, 40, 20. This comes off very simple just by pulling them two sides. And then underneath here, first of all, you have the protector. And then underneath there, you have more cubby hole space. That alone is pretty impressive. Close this, and then you have down below, reversing camera system, the exhaust pipes, and that JCW rear diffuser, which looks nice and sporty again. The car's finished off very, very well. You've also got an alarm system, so at night when the car is locked, that will flash away red. So again, deters all the potential thieves out there. Look at the finish of it. It's just, it's sporty, it feels good, it looks good. And it does a cracking job. And like I said, 10% deposit, £439 a month on a PCP package. It doesn't seem like a lot for a nearly new car. Let's go back to the driver's zone. So the first thing you'll notice is this lovely BMW Mini do a great steering wheel. Nice and sporty, it's padded. You've then got the front sections here. Multifunctional with a lovely ceramic finish. Stereo controls, Bluetooth controls are there. You've got the dial in front of you with the speedo and sort of the rev and fuel on that side as well. Put it into reverse, the reversing camera comes on. It's, you can't really want much more out of a car like this. This is a brilliant car. Great miles per gallon, around 40. More than enough power of 136 brake horsepower. Brilliant, brilliant car. Chili red, that full JCW pack on, sliding roof, the 19 inch circuit wheels. Under manufacturer's warranty till 2026, and the car's only got 2,700 miles on. If you like what you see, my name and number's on the screen. Give me a call. I'd be happy to take your car in part exchange. If you have one, if you want to know more about the finance package, get in touch, ask a few questions. I'd be happy to answer them. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye now.